And in just 30 hours from now, fans are going to be back at Bills Stadium rooting on their team in Orchard Park for the first playoff game in 25 years. But uh, it's not going to look exactly like that. Extensive measures, of course, have been taken to make sure that this event, Ed, is going to be safe for those 6,700 super lucky fans who get to be there. No kidding, right? It all started with testing on Wednesday and Thursday. It even impacts the way fans go in and out of the stadium. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Taylor Epps live in Orchard Park for us this morning. Breaking down tomorrow's procedures. Taylor, good morning to you. Go Bills. That's exactly right, Ed and Katie. We're all feeling the excitement of this long-awaited playoff game right here at home. But, of course, we won't have that Bills Mafia crowd here having fun and breaking tables here at Bills Stadium. Things will actually be a lot quieter around town, and police say a lot of the surrounding streets will be closed. The Erie County Sheriff's Office released parking information Thursday afternoon, saying the section of Abbott Road in front of the stadium will be closed starting at 9.30 tomorrow morning and will stay closed until after the game. Those with parking passes will be able to access lots 2 and 6 from Abbott Road, but they're asking all other drivers to avoid the area entirely. But Big Tree Road will be open throughout the day. Now, both the sheriff's office and Orchard Park police will be enforcing new procedures and say they're expecting a quiet day as a result. So let's break down the rules for the game tomorrow. Anyone without a ticket cannot be on stadium property. Bill security and Erie County Sheriff's deputies will be watching which obviously means there will be no tailgating on Bill's lots or private lots since Orchard Park police have not issued any parking permits this year. To keep crowds small when the fans arrive, they will enter it in a staggered fashion using all gates around the stadium starting two hours before kickoff. Police just ask that you follow the rules so everyone can enjoy the game. Be patient with us. Uh, please, you know, follow the rules. We're trying to keep everybody safe and, and healthy. And, you know, we're looking forward to hosting additional games as the, as the Bills continue to win. And uh, we, we look forward to uh, hopefully a Super Bowl appearance. Once you're inside the stadium, your mask must be worn at all times, except when you're eating or drinking, and all concessions will be serving the same food, so you don't have to walk around the stadium. And police say fans understand that this is all in the name of safety, and they're expecting things to run smoothly. And as you heard him say there, Ed, they're looking forward to hosting more games if things go well on the field. And Ed, how exciting would that be? And super exciting. I mean, this was huge in and of itself for Western New York. The first home playoff game in 25 years. Add two to that list would be even better. Let's take it all the way to the Super Bowl or just focus on the task at hand. Either way, it's a great weekend here in Western New York. Taylor, thank you.